Do I wear wigs every day? Have I worn wigs in videos that you guys don't know about? Am I bald? Find out now. What's up everyone? Today I'm doing a video that's a little bit different. It's a little bit out of my comfort zone. Quick disclaimer, I am not bald. Just getting that out there right now. This is my hair. I have fine hair, but I do have hair. And thank God I do because Lord knows I would look like Humpty Dumpty if I was bald. So I'm grateful for that. Have I worn wigs in my previous videos? I have not worn wigs in any of my videos, you guys, except one of them. And it's so funny because none of you guys noticed I was wearing a wig in that video. It's actually my chubby bunny, chubby bunny challenge. Nobody noticed I was wearing a wig. Or if you did notice, nobody commented saying anything. Anywho, that's the first time I've ever worn a wig. And the reason I wore it was because Divas Wigs, the company, they contacted me and they sent me a wig to review. I actually really liked how the wig came out. I mean, nobody noticed I was wearing one in my video. And I actually posted a picture on Instagram too. Nobody noticed it there either. So I'm guessing it was a really good wig. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do the review right now and get straight into this. All right, so my wig came in this box. It has the whole logo thing going on the letters and it's like in a gold metallic. And, oh my God, line's going bad. But yeah, okay, so let's open it right up. I actually opened up the package already so my wig is just sitting there on the bed right now. But I'm just gonna show you guys how it came. God, where am I gonna put this at? We're gonna bring a typo in here. It originally came in this box, I mean in this box, in this bag, this FedEx bag, whatever, and that box, this box came in it, the one that I just showed you guys. Inside the box, it was this bag, which says, again, the logo on it, divaswigs.com, and the wig came inside of this. I still don't know how the hell the wig fit in here, I think it's because I already used it, maybe that's why I expanded already, but let me show you the wig, girl, because I don't know how the hell it fit in here in the first place. This big old wig fit in this. It's pretty huge, you guys. This is like the size of my freaking torso. <laughs> and, oh my god. It is ruining my lighting again. But yeah, this is the wig right here. And I should have showed you what it came. Okay. This is just... I'm sorry but this video is all over the place, you guys. It's just I should have unboxed it on here, but I decided not to. I got this wig about a week ago. About a week ago. I... Okay, so the wig came in here. <laughs> It's like a little net. This is not the one that you put on your head. This is just what the wig came in and it kind of holds it in place. Then we got a wig cap. This goes on your head and this just holds your head together. It holds your hair together and it makes it much easier to apply your wig. Then they just send you like a little um, instructions for daily use. I should have read this because I was struggling putting it on but it's okay. Nobody ever reads instructions. Then they um, send you a little thing that says they're looking forward to your returning and they give you a little discount and all that. And that's all that's in the box. Okay, so let me explain the whole wig thingy. I'm just dropping everything. Oh well. Alright, so the wig originally came with lace in front of it, but I cut it off. There's lace inside right here, as you can see, but it actually expanded out in about an inch or two. Maybe an inch and a half. So I cut that off because I guess, I mean, I think you're supposed to cut the lace off, right? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'll just cut it off because uh, I don't know what I'm doing. So I just did that and it worked for me, so yeah. And this is what I came up with. When I first opened up the box, I actually thought it was going to look really fake because it didn't have a part. And I'm not sure if it was meant to have a part. It probably was. I couldn't really see it. What I did is I made my part, I started plucking hairs out because I saw that in a video and I also put a little bit of concealer on it to make a natural looking part. So here's the wig and I would show you how to put it on my head but I think that would take a little bit too long because I'm not used to putting wigs on. So yeah, I'm gonna go put this on and I'll be right back. Alright you guys, so I'm back with my wig on. I'm not sure how the wig looks on camera but just act like I didn't tell you that I'm wearing a wig. And it doesn't really look like one, right? I mean, maybe on camera it comes off a little fake. I don't know. But in person, you can't really tell. My parents didn't even know I was wearing it. My dad was like, you're not wearing a wig. I hope it's coming off on camera as real as it looks in person. It is so much hair, you guys. I put some in the back, but look at this. It's ridiculous. It's so much hair. And that's kind of good because when it sheds, um, I'm not going to worry about it shedding because I'm still going to have so much hair in this. And this is synthetic hair. And it feels pretty real. You could straighten it. I just straightened the roots because it was curly from the roots and it was way too big for me. So I straightened the roots and it worked. This synthetic wig is $100 and I think that's freaking cheap. I mean, I don't know much about wigs, but I do wear extensions and I know that they're well over $200, $300. 
sometimes up to $300 for a full head of hair. $100 is pretty amazing to me. I especially recommend these wigs to um, YouTubers out there that film videos. If you make videos, you understand the struggle of doing your hair and makeup just for a video. And it kind of sucks sometimes you don't want to get ready, so um, it definitely cuts time off the getting ready process. And what I did in my other video in my um, bunny challenge thing, I actually styled it. I put it back like this. And that's how I had my hair. And yeah, nobody noticed I was wearing it, so I'm guessing it looks pretty natural. I mean, now that I'm telling you, maybe you're going to go back and maybe you're, you'll notice it now. So I freaking love this. It's amazing. I hope Diva's wigs contact me again because I will wear their wigs. And I am not ashamed to say that. If I feel lazy to get ready one day, I will pop this wig on before I make a video. I don't give a damn. I will wear it in my videos. Maybe not in all of them, but when I, feel, when I don't feel like getting ready, I'll definitely wear it. And yeah, it's really comfortable. It has um, adjustable straps in the back. I should have showed you, but I ain't about to take the wig off to show you right now because I already got it on. It's really voluminous, you guys. Look at this. This is crazy. Like, for $100, you guys. <laughs> and I know a lot of you guys that are subscribed to me have a YouTube channel. So, girl, get on and get yourself, like, two wigs, like a straight one and a curly one. $100, I mean, that's amazing. And this hair feels so real, you guys. It's synthetic, but it feels real. Oh, look at this. It's so much hair. It's just... I can't look at if I try to sponge this thing up or whatever look at that it's just insane but obviously I don't want that going on because that's gonna look a little bit too much I wouldn't wear this out only because it's a little bit hot and like the summer's coming but I'll definitely wear this in my videos if I have to if I don't feel like getting ready especially for Halloween imagine with all these different wigs just to pop on for Halloween like tutorials and stuff this is so cool I'm actually really thinking about purchasing a straight one that way when I want to wear straight hair in my videos I'll just put my hair on you know and then when I want to wear curly hair I'll just pop this one on but yeah you guys that's it honestly it might not look natural because I'm telling you guys but let's be real if I didn't tell you I was wearing a wig right now you wouldn't even notice thank you so much Diva's Wigs for sending me this wig it came out way better than I thought it was gonna be just thank you guys so much for watching this video I have nothing else to say and I will see you in my next one bye guys